Why can't I disable bad loot? Um, I don't know. At least you set portal? Yeah, dude. I learned that from playing Diablo 2 as a young, young, uh... You can do things to your butthole? That's facts! Boys and girls, dude. Let's get them all, okay? Colonoscopy is incoming. Well, I guess girls don't really need colonoscopies, right? Or do- They do. Or, I was- Stop. Stop. Next. Next. I had- I had a few over here. Oh. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm close. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Take it back. Wait. Anyways. Let me, uh... Let's get out of here. I hate that I just <laughs> said that. <laughs> oh no! Hello. Hi. It's Kale here, once again. Uh, day two diary for the MF character. Decided to try out some T15 canyons as part of a project uh, involving MF and having beanies as an Aurobot in there to make things a little bit smoother. And it, it definitely worked. Uh, having extra auras, who would have thought? Having an Aurobot makes your build feel way stronger. Quite nice. Uh, I actually ended up swapping to Deadeye just to test it out uh, for, you know, some clear speed and such. It also gives some survivability with evading and things like that, uh, ailment immunity, etc, etc. All in all, didn't get a whole lot done. Was just kind of working on the project, messing around on stream, having fun with people. Having a good time overall. You could probably catch me live over there. Uh, I should be live just later today. Here shortly, at least. And, yeah, that's pretty much it. There's not really a whole lot to talk about. Just a quick, tiny little update. Didn't change really much about the build. Got some XP. Got some money. Uh, started working on another build as well. Just as another side project. Just to keep the videos rolling and such. Uh, but yeah, there's, there's really not much to talk about today. Thank you guys for watching this quick little update. And I will catch y'all later. Have a good day. Peace. Hello, hello, it's Kale. Uh, another quick update on what I've been doing in the game. I ran an MF character, a ranger, um, Deadeye, I believe it was, in T2 Towers a lot with Beanies. He is the editor um, for the videos here. And he was running an Aurobot to make sure that I wasn't a uh, baby back bitch on my MF character. And I, I still felt as if the character was a bit too squishy, even with a lot of investment, uh, and the damage was also pretty bad, even with a lot of investment. And that's just because the character is made to get more loot. And through my personal experience, I would say that it didn't feel worth it uh, because of the nerfs that they've implemented onto MF characters and things like that recently, and just over all through throughout the past. It is really hard to build more quant. Uh, in the end, I would say I had about 85 quant and then if you added the Divination Distillate onto that, I had whatever the 18% is. So close close to 100% quant uptime throughout the maps. Close to 200% rarity throughout the maps. And it just didn't feel like it was something that I would do again, to be honest with you. MF just didn't feel that powerful. The character was really bad without the Aura Bot. It was hard to clear like just normal red maps. Um, not in the damage, but in the surviving department, you would just get one shot at any point. I had some really, really, really strong jewels. Pretty decent life, I would say, for a MF character. It was like 4,500, maybe 4,200, somewhere around there. And so I moved on to a Penance Brand character, which is actually the one that I'm logged into now. And this character is currently working on delving, but also I just change a few things on my tree, get rid of this cluster jewel, and me and Beanies are now farming T15, 100% uh, Delirious Canyons, and we are testing out which delirious content is actually going to be the most profitable. So we're testing out Breach, Harbinger, Scarabs, and Currency, um, any of the ones that are supposed to be really harbinger, uh, really profitable. Sorry about that. And so, I don't know, I just make a few changes, and the character is ready to go for maps. Right now, as you can see, I'm set up for Delving. I only have 181 ES, one life. That's just because it's immune to Chaos Damage on the ground in Delve, which is really fun and fair. I'm at the point now where I just get one shot whenever I'm doing that kind of stuff. So I would say this character has come really far. I have a really, really good gear just in general. Um, I'm missing a few like really top tier upgrades, but a lot of my jewels are 
really insane. They're either triple or quadruple crit multi for me. Um, things like that. You know, corrupted blood immunity, damage pin on my Thread of Hope. Pretty good Watcher's Eye, like 15x or so. You know, it's just a work in progress at the moment. Just at level 97 today, doing some Chayula Breaches. It's pretty rippy, but all in all, it's a, it's a pretty strong character. I like it a lot. Uh, I changed, I've been changing the flasks around quite a bit just to test out a bunch of new stuff. Crafted some nice boots. Um, that's that's about it. Just a quick update on the past few days. We set a um, first day build diary for the MF character, and I kind of just fell out of love with it after that day because it didn't feel like it was something that I liked playing, and it also didn't feel like something that I felt was worth it. It didn't feel like I was getting more drops than I would without MF. So, yeah, that's that's pretty much all I've got for you. Thank you for watching. I appreciate you sticking around. And I'll be live on twitch.tv slash Caligoose, of course. And it'll be somewhere on the screen. Over there. Or there. Somewhere. And that's about it. Yeah. Thank you, guys. Peace.